Located in Guatemala City, the 18th zone is one of the most dangerous and discriminated against neighborhoods in Latin America. Unemployment is high, and finding jobs for the 800,000 people who live there is almost impossible. Many companies refuse to employ people from the 18th zone because they assume they have ties to the gangs that dominate the area. Uno siente miedo, temor de decir dónde vive, porque automáticamente es como que uno está diciendo que uno es un delincuente. Cuando vieron mi barbería que era la zona 18, me dijeron que por ese motivo no me contrataban. Existe un estigma sobre los ciudadanos que están optando a un empleo al momento de irlo a buscar y que principalmente residen en la zona 18. Tortrix, Guatemala's most popular snack brand, made it their mission to help the nearly one million Guatemalans who feel unwanted in their own country. So we created the only institution that can represent them all, an embassy, the Embassy of the 18th Zone. We rented a house outside 18th Zone and equipped it like a real embassy. One of the most important human resources professionals in Guatemala was named Ambassador. To launch, we invited media and executives of the largest companies of the country to the embassy to start a diplomatic dialogue with 18th Zone. We introduced EmbajadaZona18.org, a website where companies enroll in the project and post job openings, and candidates upload resumes and apply for jobs, free of discrimination. Every resume we received was reviewed by a human resources specialist and then circulated among the participating companies. We also offered free regular vocational training courses to candidates at the embassy. And in only one month, we proved how necessary the embassy was for Guatemalans. El de Embajada de la Zona 18 fue lo máximo para mí porque me dio resultados que yo necesitaba a la hora de conseguir un empleo. The program has earned over two million dollars in free press through traditional and social channels. And best of all, we created an established symbol to the city that will end a social prejudice and help 800,000 people to reach a better future.